Hello, welcome back guys to the channel. This is once again the Daily Dose and for today we will be doing another diecast news and update. So we got tons of cars for today's episode from different brands and we got a mix of European cars, American cars uh, and JDMs. So if you like uh, to know the latest news in the diecast world, please do subscribe to the channel. So let's start today's episode with a bunch of new cars coming soon from Para 64. Para 64, if you are not familiar with them, they do make tons of awesome cars, although their catalog is not yet as plentiful as other well known and more established brands out there, but they do have tons of pretty good looking cars. So, first up, we got this BMW M3 and they call this colorway Sao Paulo yellow. So this is available in left hand and right hand drive variants. Looks awesome. Uh, yeah, the headlights and the taillights are pla plastic. So I kind of like that one a lot. Pretty good looking wheels on this M3. Good looking uh, front end right here. However, not a fan of the vents right here or the grill don't really like the grills of the new bmws i'm sorry uh, bmw fanboys out there but moving on good looking rear right here for this m3 and here's an outstanding one right here a 1987 uh, ruf rough ctr yellowbird uh, they call this colorway uh, blossom yellow so it looks awesome like this one a lot kind of reminds me of a release made by Shuko again fantastic car right here I like the wheels they are really big but it still looks good on this one awesome car and here's a recolor of the BMW M3 in Toronto red again available for left hand and right hand drive same details with the previous one it has plastic headlights plastic taillights they even have the same wheel set and look at how cool is that they both have the black uh, top right here so that's uh, yeah that's really good looking BMW M3 here is a Mercedes AMG GT 63 in Jupiter red awesome red right here it is a dark red and it looks good on this GT that is really nice again with the details I also like the uh, molding details right here it is pretty deep so I like that one a lot and it has the moon roof also so pretty good looking AMG right here GT then they've got the white version of this one also so this is the diamond white colorway again all cars available in left hand and right hand drive and here is a cool mercedes maybach gls 600 in obsidian black and kalahari gold so two colors for this At the top you see the kalahari gold while the bottom part of the car is obsidian black and it looks awesome and look at the the wheels right here the rims man that is awesome kind of unique looking so we don't see this quite often i believe and again look at the molding details on their cars man amazing one again plastic headlights plastic taillights and here is something cool although not really new but posted by hot wheels malaysia uh, i think i haven't seen this one or i, I kind of forgot but i'm sharing it to you guys this is a fantastic looking uh, 34th annual hot wheels collectors convention volkswagen t1 panel bus from the 2020 la uh, collectors convention again so awesome one kind of forgot about this one and it looks really good so the t1 panel bus as you might uh, know already is uh, slowly getting up in value and man look at how cool this one is and look at the artwork that is really awesome in gold with some purple also 
So man, that is fantastic. So again, thanks to Hot Wheels in Malaysia for the photo. And a new set right here from M2 Machines, new model kit series from them. And let's take a look at each set. So this is uh, the 1955 Chevy Bel Air. So if you won't open this, here's what you see. You still have to assemble it by the way. So it's up to you whether or not you'll keep this one carded or make this more beautiful by opening it and assembling it. Look at how many the accessories are. So two uh, sets of wheels right here as you see. Got the axles also. Man, they got the lift. So fantastic accessories and details on this set and uh, this is really cool 56 Volkswagen Beetle Deluxe USA model and same thing with the extra set of wheels man that is so cool and we got the 68 Shelby GT 500 KR in more of a like a must uh, mustard yellow color so this is really really cool damn how cool are these cars and then we got this 69 ford f100 ranger 4x4 damn again looks awesome so these cars have opening features like this one you see right here the hood see some gaps so it's telling us that that can be opened and closed so really cool stuff again and here is the chase which is limited to 750 pieces worldwide same color except it has the gold chrome accents on some parts of the car and the rims interior is also different yeah so what a fantastic piece for this set they don't have the super chase variation and last but not least check out these cool toyota land cruisers from kyosho these are 118 scale models amazing piece right here uh, this will be uh, so based on pre-order price this is around 9500 pesos close to 10,000 10, pesos or 200 or close to 200 us dollars my goodness <laughs> again these are 118 scale though and look at the details again man that is awesome they also have the white colorway i think this one looks cleaner and better than the blue one so uh, this is a right hand drive vehicle also the blue one is a right hand drive vehicle so awesome cars man and yeah that will be all for today's episode i hope you enjoyed this if you did please smash that like button subscribe to the channel especially if you like diecast cars and yeah i hope i'll be seeing you on our next episode bye bye guys thank you so much for watching once again this is the daily dose bye bye see you on our next episode